What's going on guys? My name is of course Jay and welcome yourselves back to a brand new video from TechJ UK. In today's video we are reviewing the brand new flagship phone from Oppo. This is the Oppo Find X5 Lite and Oppo have been very kind to send me out this phone for review purposes to celebrate their partnership with the brand new Sonic the Hedgehog 2 film. Now you might be thinking, why have Oppo partnered with the Sonic 2 film? Well, we all know that Sonic is best for his super quick lightning speeds and the Oppo Find X5 Lite can charge at lightning speeds just like our beloved Sonic the Hedgehog. This is all thanks to Oppo's 65 watt Super VOOC charging technology. This Super VOOC charging gives you 0 to 100% charge in just 31 minutes. Even off just a five minute charge, you are gonna get around two hours worth of gaming. These speeds are absolutely insane and really does blow the competition for a new smartphone wide open. What we're gonna be doing today is definitely put in the Super VOOC charging up to the test and see how long it takes to get to 100%. Oppo have been very nice to send out a Super VOOC branded little bag with it and they even chucked in a Sonic the Hedgehog biscuit as well. I would definitely have to hide this away from the kids. So inside this first box here, we have a clear protective case to go straight onto your phone, then the paperwork and the SIM card pin. We have the phone itself and it comes with a screen protector as standard. I know you can pick up a screen protector quite cheap these days, but it's just a nice thing that we get one included straight away. So we have a screen protector and a protective case straight out of the box. So you can tell that Oppo really do think of the customer here. It's good that they allow you to have the phone fully protected as soon as you unbox it. This is the 65 watt SuperVOOC charging adapter. Mine is the free pin version, but this will depend on what region you buy your phone from. We then get the USB type C cable included. And I must admit this is a nice thicker one than most others that you see. And lastly, a USB C to USB A adapter. So in terms of the design of this phone, it is a very light phone in terms of the weight. It comes in at just 173 grams, and we also see a nice slim depth at just 7.81 millimeters. So it's definitely not a thick and bulky phone, and it does feel really nice in your hand. So on the left hand side of the device, we have the volume up and down rocker, and also the SIM card tray. On the right hand side is just the lock button and then on the bottom we have the USB charging slot, the speaker just to the right and we also see a 3.5 millimeter headphone jack which is very rare these days but also very nice to see that included on the phone. Moving to the back of the phone, we have the Star Trails blue design. This is a really beautiful shimmery color that kind of changes as you move the phone. And Oppo have used laser direct imaging technology, which is used to imitate the pattern of Star Trails. This is by far one of the best looking backs of a phone that I have seen on the market for sure. It looks so, so good. And there is also a starlight black color option in this phone as well. So we have three cameras on the back. We have a 64 megapixel primary lens, an eight megapixel ultra wide camera as well. And then the smaller camera at the top there is a two megapixel macro lens to get real up close with your photos. So let's go through some of the main specifications of the phone and then we'll get onto the all important charge test. The Oppo Find X5 Lite runs Android 11 and comes with Color OS version 12. You're gonna be able to do some really cool and fun tweaks that standard Android phones can't do. So even though the Oppo Find X5 has light in its name, it's definitely packing some real power in terms of the specifications. This phone comes with a standard 256 of onboard storage, which I think is a really great move from them. And it can actually be expanded with a memory card as well. But just to see a 
really high capacity as standard is a real thumbs up from me. We then have a Dimensity 900 octa-core processor. This has 5G, so if you have a plan that has 5G, you're gonna be able to experience them real high lightning data speeds. And it also supports Wi-Fi 6 as well. So if you have a router that supports Wi-Fi 6, which is the world's latest Wi-Fi standard. We have eight gigabytes of RAM. They have a really cool feature in terms of the RAM. So it has RAM expansion. You can expand it an extra two, three or five gig if you've got enough storage space. So this RAM expansion is a virtual RAM. So this is a really nifty feature if you're someone who games a lot on your mobile. I play a lot of Call of Duty. That is a really resource hungry game. So I can turn on the RAM expansion. It's gonna perform even better when you're playing your games. So the screen is a 6.43 inch Super AMOLED display running at 90 Hertz. You're getting 409 pixels per inch and it's also got 800 nits of peak brightness. It's gonna work really well when you're using the phone outside when it's sunny. It's gonna still be a really bright display. A lot of other phones don't do very well in the sunlight at all. You're not gonna have a problem with this. I must say overall, the screen on the Oppo Find X5 Lite is absolutely brilliant, especially for a phone of this price as well. Compared to some of the big hitters on the market, I think this does really compare very, very well with them. Okay, so that concludes the charging test for the Oppo Find X5 Lite. I used the official cable and the 65 watt SuperVOOC charger. And after 31 minutes, we was up to 95%, so pretty much full charge in just 31 minutes. I noticed it took a few more minutes just to get to 100%, so in official records of my test, it took us 37 minutes to get to 100%. A lot of these phones do take longer in the last few percent in order to protect the battery. I was blown away that after just about 10 minutes, we was already up over 40%, and after 20 minutes, we was up over 70%. So this phone really does charge at absolute lightning speeds, just like Sonic the Hedgehog. Find X5 Lite has a 4,500 milliamp battery. The way in which the Oppo charges so quick is because the actual battery inside of the phone is split into two cells and not just one. And this also means that it doesn't degrade as quickly over time. If you're someone who really likes playing games on your phone, the Oppo Find X5 Lite has some really great features in terms of gaming. For example, there is the AI frame rate stabilizer, so it prevents frame loss and lagging while you're playing. And there's also a quick startup feature, so it takes you back to where you was with your game. If you're like me, I might play for 15, 20 minutes, come off and do something else, and then it might be in the evening where I want a quick blast. For example, my real racing, free takes me straight back into the game right where I left off. This phone has multi-layer graphite sheet. This multi-cooling system is here to keep the most intensive gaming session from overheating your phone. So you haven't got to worry if you're playing for a long time. It also has five real-time temperature sensors so it can work out areas of your phone that are working harder and it can then detect it and call it efficiently. So there we have it guys, that is the review of the Oppo Find X5 Lite. Let me know what you think of this phone in the comments down below. I think overall this brand new flagship phone from Oppo is absolutely brilliant. It's an all round good phone. To get your phone from zero to 100% in just over half hour is absolutely insane and I can 100% see why Oppo wanted to partner with the Sonic 2 film. Also, this Super AMOLED display that we see on this phone is really sharp and vivid. You're getting really great bright colors. I must say the back of this phone really is so nice to look at 
and feels absolutely great in your hand. The cameras also do perform really well considering the price of this phone as well is a few hundred pounds cheaper than some of the latest iPhones for example. And if you're into your gaming and multitasking then the performance of the Find X5 Lite really does excel in this category as well. If you want to know anything more about the phone, then please pop a comment in the section down below and I'll get back to you. Please like the video if you've enjoyed it and subscribe to the channel if you are new. Thanks for watching as always guys, and I'll see you in the next video.